clip shows, it, yeah, Michael Mann, a scientist at Penn State University, is talking about how many millions of dollars the Koch brothers spend on, on disinformation campaigns uh, to confuse the American public about about you know climate change, and it, you know he said the 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 you know the the information's all there. The 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 fact is, is that, that there's climate change, and that these people stand a profit uh, by people not believing it. What's happening? And solar power—that's what we were talking about. The so, man, I don't know why why this country fights like people tooth and nail against solar power. And uh, the, the scientists even mentioned that, that Neil Tyson Degrassi, who I love. Uh, one of his tweets, I guess, lately was uh, that if aliens were watching us, they they would be they would be completely confused by the uh, the fact by the fact that we illogically like um, mine all this uh, all this stuff out of the out of the earth when there's all this free energy out solar energy wind energy he said they would be completely stymied that they would be baffled by our behavior and it's all because uh, powerful people are controlling us and they, they keep it that way and they don't want people to know any better and Aldous Huxley wrote about that and I think it was in the 20s even that, that you know Aldous Huxley among I'm sure other people were saying that um, that it's already too late that the 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 coal and and gas that power companies had, had already bought the the political system and this is Huxley in uh, after many a uh, summer dies the swan which I think was published in 1929 and he also used the word holocaust which I don't think came in uh, was popular until well after World War II. I think a lot of people would 